We've heard what Liz Truss has to say yesterday in relation to the checks. Um, do you believe that uh, the Agriculture Minister will stop those checks very soon? I think it's very clear from the official advice that he has had uh, that it would be inappropriate to continue. In fact, he would have no legal basis to allow the checks to continue uh, without the imprimatur or the agreement of the Northern Ireland Executive. Uh, he sought permission from the Northern Ireland Executive yesterday. And for political reasons, Sinn Féin refused to allow that paper on the agenda. So there is no legal basis for the checks to continue. He is well within his rights, and indeed he should uh, take this step to stop the checks um, at our ports in Northern Ireland, because there is no legal underpinning for them to take place at all. Well, you will know that Sinn Féin argues that there's already been a position adopted by the Northern Ireland Executive, and that is that the checks that are currently there should continue. I presume that you would reject that uh, assessment that they have made. Well, there was legal advice that tilted toward that impression a year ago, uh, but it is now very clear, following a number of judgments within our High Court, uh, that that interpretation, uh, that, that approach from the Executive is wrong. Uh, the legal advice, and uh, this was born out of uh, the pre-action protocol letter for a potential judicial review. Uh, and it is clear that the minister has legal advice to say that he is on shaky ground. Uh, of course, you know that politically we do not support the protocol. We oppose the protocol. Uh, we have stood in its way. And now this avenue is open to us, uh, which indicates very clearly uh, that without the support of the Northern Ireland Executive, where the Northern Ireland Executive takes the decision that these checks, which are a barrier to trade within our own country, which are frustrating our economy, which are damaging the lives of consumers, are damaging businesses that operate within our country of the United Kingdom, that without that agreement within the Executive, they should stop. So the Agriculture Minister Edwin puts as well within his right now, and I think he should take that step. Once he has firm legal basis for doing so, which I believe he has, that he can order a stop to these checks which are harming society in Northern Ireland.